What's going on, Shady People? Shady Penguin here. Welcome back to the next episode of our Pokemon Sacred Gold Egglock. Today, ho, oh, today, we're gonna be doing so much hatching. I'm really glad that I didn't hatch the two that we have right here. Bam, bam, at the end of the last episode, because we are actually going to be getting a lot more Pokemon today. Uh, I'm going to test right now and see if it'll just go to our box, but uh, Lyra did tell us to visit the Fossil Center. And that's exactly what we're gonna do. I feel like this entire episode might just be us hatching eggs because, um, boy oh boy, it's, it's, uh, <laughs> this is the bicycle. Wait, 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 wait! Shady, it's good to see you again. This is an in-progress base that is built for archeologists, so it's a good place for me to stay around. You know, if you find or get given any ancient looking items, you should bring them to me. I might be able to help decipher their meaning. Oh yeah? Hello, thank you for coming to our archaeological center. This place used to be pretty useless and Cynthia showed up and then all changed. Her prowess is incredible. That Stephen Stone is pretty good with archaeology too. Anyway, since this is your first visit, let me give you a generous gift. The best archaeology has to offer. We got a roof fossil. Bam! We got a cloth fossil. Bam! Oh my gosh. We got a helix fossil. Bam! We got a dome. Okay, hold on. So we got mad fossils. Mad fossils, skull fossil. Now, normally I would say this only counts as one encounter. However, because it's an egg lock, and <laughs> we're losing so many Pokemon, uh, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna use them all. But my question is, is it really worth the time to go ahead and let's, let, let's just see. Let's see what happens. We're gonna go with the Helix fossil. Extract the Pokemon, yes, absolutely. Give me some time, come back later. Like, we know we have six Pokemon, and we know there's no randomization in this game, so we're not gonna find a random fossil. Uh, let me see, you've extracted Ammonite. Okay, and you see the full, see, okay, listen. Guys, I honestly think it's better for us to just grab six eggs than to do, grab a Pokemon, put a Pokemon, get it back, put a Pokemon back, get it back. Might as well just grab six eggs for each of these fossils and we'll know, hey, these fossils are off limits. There's, I don't think there's gonna be any more fossils in the game, maybe there will be, but we'll be able to go back to this episode and see which, whenever we get a new fossil, we'll know. But we're gonna grab, so we're gonna grab mad Pokemon right now. We have eight, we have eight. <laughs> we have eight Pokemon to hatch. Oh dear Lord, everyone's demons. Everyone's demons. Um, They're coming to life, they're coming to life. Everyone's demons are coming to life. Move Pokemon. Okay, let's go ahead and empty our party real quick because let's be honest. I feel like, I feel like, wait, this will be the easiest way to do this. This will be the easiest way. Actually, it won't be the easiest way. What am I doing? It won't matter. It won't matter. Okay, so let's do this. All the fossils, just so you guys know, are level 20. Uh, and I believe we are, we, we went through the boxes again? Really? Yeah, everything has two except for this one. Wow, all right. That's crazy. We've had so many eggs. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna grab something for our drowsy here. now. What we're gonna do after this is we're just gonna grab six eggs and we know that they're all gonna be level 20 because uh, it is in fact level 20 when you get a fossil back. So let's go ahead, let's roll. Our first number is gonna be a two and our second number is going to be a one. So LeBron James is right here. I believe we got the drowsy first. LeBron is gonna be level 18. Oh, who is LeBron? I'm so excited. Who is LeBron? Look at Turtwig. We're looking almost like a shiny Turtwig right here. All right, we got to go ahead. We got to run around, unfortunately. Um, let's just run around in here because I don't feel like going outside and smelling the fresh air. Ain't nobody about that. I really think this entire episode is going to be eight hatches and then probably calling it a day, uh, which is fine. It's not the end of the world. We might be able to get a little stuff. We might get some stuff done. I'm not sure. It depends. LeBron! Thank you so much for sending in your chimp charm. We're gonna go ahead and use this as a dupe, uh, simply because we have a we currently have a a chim char that is nice and ripe for the picking. So we want to get variety here. These you guys love your fire type Pokemon, don't you? All right, we're back at the front. Look at Turtwig and Chimchar in the same area. That's great. All right, I'm rolling my die. I'm rolling my die. That's a one. Hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And then we're gonna roll. A one. Okay, we have to re-roll for that because Chikorita is right there. A three. So we're grabbing this egg, which will be level 18, and it is a Leon. Hold it, hold on, holding a choice band. Why can't I just go? I wish I could just go held items. Just give me this held item. 
but it just says an egg can't hold an item. Little do you know. All right, let's do this. So the choice band will be used on this Pokemon only. Uh, not that we have to use it, but if we want to, Leon will have a choice band and Leon is going to hatch into, well, he's a little happy. He's not sad at all. He is not sad at all. My Lanta, my little baby Lanta. Oh. Let us see what we shall see when we see it. It is? A pseudo Wudo named Leon. What the heck? I did not expect a pseudo Wudo. All right. Thank you so much for your pseudo Wudo, a brand new unique Pokemon. Let's check out its moves and make sure it's legit. Pseudo Wudo. It's alert to sound. It's got Pokerus with Wood Hammer, Low Kick, Defense Curl, and Rollout. I'm pretty positive those are all legit. If any of these are illegit, you know what? We just gotta do it. We just gotta check. What a shame. Pseudo Wudo. Cerebi. This is why this episode might actually end up taking the full 30 minutes. Wow, I typed in Odo Wow Wow. Odo Wow Wow and it didn't come up. Oh wow. Pseudo Wudo Cerebi. There we go. Uh, Gen 4. And we're looking like a little bit of uh, a little bit of rollout. We got that. What else did you have? You have Leaf Blade. I don't think you get Leaf Blade, man. That's crazy. Uh, wood Hammer. Wait, Wood Hammer. You might get. You are a tree. Ooh, Wood Hammer might be illegit. Oh no, Wood Hammer. Wow, you're just born with it. That's awesome. So are you with Low Kick and Rollout and Defense Curl? Sweet. Is Defense Curl legit? How is Defense Curl going to be the one that 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 throws me off here? There's no way. Okay, it's an egg move. Sweet! So you're gonna be level 18. You have Rockhead. You're protected from recoil, which is really good with the wood hammer. So let's get you up to level 18 real quick, Black, and hatch our next Pokemon. What are you trying to learn? Flail? Get out of here. We're not learning Flail. I'd rather have Defense Curl over Flail. That's how much I despise Flail. Right there. It's just, it's, it's just, it's, it's not a move. It's not a move that should exist. I don't care. Rock Throw is a move that should exist. Uh, one which we will get rid of rollout for. Rollout's pretty cool, don't get me wrong. Like, defense curl rollout, super cute. Uh, get that plus one attack right away. We will not get Mimic. And level 18, Leon. I'm gonna have him stand behind us for a little while. I like the way his overall sprite looks. It's freaking fantastic. Uh, let's go ahead and let's get our next Pokemon for our level 20 Turtwig. So we're actually gonna grab, we're gonna grab five Pokemon right now. Uh, actually, let's just grab, yeah, let's grab Hall. We'll figure it out. Let's grab one. We got a three and a six. So the last egg in row three or column three, holding the lucky egg. Ugh, these items are like, they, 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 they trigger me a little bit, honestly. Okay. So you're the only Pokemon that can hold a lucky egg. Uh, at least this one. I think we have another one actually, or someone had another one and they died. So you're gonna be level 20. Got it. Uh, what we're gonna do is since these are, well actually we'll have to have this one because this one had an item. Let's just do it one by one. Look at this. Demonic possession. My toes are on top of my head. Pseudo Wudo looks. This is the way Pseudo Wudo should have originally looked. I'll tell you what. This is a this is ten out of ten graphics, my friends. Ten out of ten. And they're gonna be level twenty, so we don't gotta do any grinding. Uh, Mudkip. Mudkip, and you guys know that I'm gonna go ahead and choose a shady person to name this after. I'm going uh, back to the last episode. It is a male mudkip. What do we got in the comments? Hmm. Actually, I kind of like this name, Soul Flake. Soul Flake 1. Of course it sounds like an ice type Pokemon. We already have Snowbell. Snowbell and Soul Flake sound like they should be hanging out at the at like a, a Polish bar. Polish ice bar. Soul Flake, thank you so much for being a shady person and commenting on this video. Uh, really appreciate the support. And of course, guys, it's adamant with bite, ice ball, stomp, and double edge. Pretty certain those are all legit. Um, what did I want to say? What do I want to say? Oh, of course, guys, don't forget to crush that thumbs up down below if you want to see an hour of power on Sunday. We're actually a couple episodes back. We're kind of falling behind. We might not crush it this week. Uh, so you might just have the one and done and be good with it. Uh, but of course, if you guys want to go for it, I, I, I mean, I say go for it. Why did I not want to learn water again? Because I'm allergic to water. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. I am allergic to water. You know, I drink like a two. Wait, what did I just forget? I forgot bite and learn bite. That's terrible. 
what happens when you click. There we go. Soul Flake evolved into a Mars Tomp, wants to learn Mud Shot. We'll learn that, we'll get rid of Double Edge. I do not want anyone with Double Edge ever again. I will tell you what, nothing is having Double Edge. Wants to learn Yawn, Ah! Uh... Just get rid of Bide, I hate Bide. Just get rid of Bite for Bide. Change one letter and I'm miserable. One letter and I'm miserable, okay. So now the rest of these Pokemon, actually we have to give you the Lucky Egg too, just so we don't forget. Actually, no, it's not gonna work, it's not gonna work. So back it out, back it out like you left something. Uh, lucky Egg, give this to you. And Choice Band, we will, just so we know, give this to you. Uh, now let's go ahead and go to the next box, which is right here, and we're just gonna roll, because we're gonna, we get, we get a total of six eggs now. So let's grab four and then two. So first we're gonna grab six, can't do that, three. And then we're gonna go ahead and grab five. So we have Sarah holding the oval stone. Oh boy. Sarah and the oval stone, what could you be? What likes an oval stone? What Pokemon likes oval stone? Is that Chansey? We just have to hatch it because we have to know which Pokemon it is in order to get the oval stone, unfortunately. That's just the way the world works. We can't just grab four. This is exactly why we're just making omelets today, boys. We're cracking some eggs. And making some omelets. What do we got? Sarah is a happy. Speaking of cracking eggs, so Oval Stone. Uh, I guess. I guess there's something. Thank you so much for the happy. You beautiful shady person whoever submitted it named Sarah. Uh, she is quite, quite happy. Uh, let's see, you have Pokerus. I guess they're automatically gonna Pokerus now because of my, my party members. Pound Charm, Aromatherapy, and Metronome. Looking legit, too legit to quit. You guys let me know if it's not. Because yeah, we're just gonna do that because I think today's episode is literally just gonna be this. So instead of taking even more time to check each one. Wait, what does this say? Makes a certain Pokemon evolve. Okay, so it makes Chansey evolve into Blissey. Okay, okay, so we got that, we got that. Let's go ahead. And let's, uh, let's rare Candy Sarah up to level 20. Cause she was a trade in for one of our six fossils. Wants to learn copycat, we don't want that. We don't need no copycat, you're not a cat. You're a, what, are you an animal? What is Chansey? It's just a giant egg? It's Humpty, I guess it's Humpty Dumpty. I guess it's pretty much Humpty Dumpty. That makes sense, right? Sure, Wish, I actually will learn Wish. We're gonna go ahead and get rid of Charm for Wish. You're gonna be, if you enter our team at some point, you're gonna be super utility, I will tell you what. I feel like actually, Blissey's such an incredible Pokemon to have in Nuzlocke. Like absolutely incredible that I wouldn't mind adding Happiny to the team. I mean, we have the power who has our normal type covered and we have like huge fighting weaknesses all the time. So I'm not sure if we'll do that, but here we go. Let's go ahead and survey says, we got a three again. Ooh, look at these lucky threes today. We never saw threes before, and a one! So we got No Name Jones over here. That's what I would call you, No Name Jones. And we'll see what you hatch into. Show us, show us the goods. Let's crack this bad boy open. This is our second fossil. We got four more to go after this. Second fossil, four more to go. Second fossil, four more to go. Second fossil. It's a, it's actually a fossil, Kabuto! Oh, I miss you, Kabuto. You bring back so many memories. Oh, Kabuto, a male, a male Pokemon. What do we have? Let's see. Let's see, let's see. Ethan! I'm naming you after Ethan Kuzner. Ethan, thank you so much for your comment. I appreciate it. Ethan, I'm just gonna call you Ethan. Ethan the Kabuto. Oh, I love the name Ethan. All right, let's check you out, Kabuto, so everyone can tell us if you're legit or not. Looks like you have Dig already. Dig, knock off Bubble Beam and Aur Aurora Beam. Pretty sure that is too legit, too quit. Give me that rare candy, and let's elevate these levels. Let us elevate these levels like no tomorrow. I wanna learn Absorb. Actually, you're not gonna learn Absorb. So many O's looking like a Bubble Beam. I saw Bubble Beam and I think, and I think of good music. What? Leer? No, no, no. You don't want to learn Leer, man. You already instill fear. You, your eyes, you have two sets of eyes. 
People think those are your eyes right there, and then they're not. Mud shots? Nah. Nah, 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 nah. I feel like you evolve at level 25, which will be great for us. It's so cool that we got a fossil from our fossil. All right, so we can grab four more. We can grab four more total. Let's go ahead and grab our die before we grab eggs and see what we get. We got a five and a one. So right here, No Name Jones, since this Pokemon doesn't have an item, we can actually try our, ah, no, no, it's gotta do this way. Cause then if the next one we grab has an item, then it's like, oh, poo on you, poo on you, and poo on you. Here we go. One, two, three, four. There we go. I, it's always right before five. What do we got? Let me name this for another shady person. Shady person survey says, Skarmory. Oh, that is a dangerous Pokemon. That is a dangerous, dangerous, dangerous Pokemon. What do we got going on? Um, all right, you know what? Spike for Tar. I'm gonna go with Spike. I like, oh, this is a female. You know, we're still gonna go with Spike. Spike, thank you so much for your comment. Uh, Spike the Skarmory, she is sassy as anything. Sassy Spike is here to stay. Let's see what you got. I kinda wanna see what you look like following behind me. Uh, Sassy Spike is timid. Ooh, and it's got Steel Wing, Brave Bird, Whirlwind, and Agility. I think those are all legit moves. You guys can confirm with me, but man, Timid Skarmory. That is an option and a half. I will tell you what. That is an option and a half. My goodness. All right, so we can grab three more eggs. I told you guys it was going to take like the entire thing. Imagine if I wasn't speeding up. Just imagine. I mean, the only we, we would have bite. I'll tell you that we would not have bite, and I wouldn't have gotten rid of bite for yawn just because bite is high and yawn is. Uh, that's pretty much my logic. That's why I choose my moves on my Pokemon. Let me, let me imagine the Pokemon doing. One one Fury Attack. Uh, I think your move set is pretty legit right now. Uh, I really like the Whirlwind in this game. I think Whirlwind and Adriano hack is super, super, super good. Uh, we're not gonna get faint, sorry, man. We're not getting fainted, sorry, man. Okay, so let's deposit three of these Pokemon. Let's go all the way over to box 18. I'm gonna have to, uh, after this, I'm gonna keep happy to, actually, I'm gonna keep the Skarmory behind me. I'm gonna have to reorganize our boxes uh, because I'm running out of room. I need an actual death box an actual storage box, so. We're gonna end up, I'm gonna end up releasing all the Pokemon that we caught and then just uh, resetting the boxes up with eggs. Uh, so we were on box number, I think we're here. Come on, seven. So we just did this, yes, we just did this. So we're getting three more eggs starting right here. Uh, is it right here? Why are we missing three Pokemon from here? It looks like that box already had three Pokemon taken, or this could have been a box that was missing an egg. We're just gonna go with it, because I know that we just took an empty egg and didn't trade a Pokemon. It was next to the C dot. So let's go ahead. Oh, that's my comment section. That is not, uh, that's not a die. It's rapidly tapping a screen. All right, survey says. We got a five again. Yikes, man. We have five again. Okay. Fresh water. We're gonna leave that one on there. Just because, you know what, I appreciate the water, I do. Um, but at the end of the day, it's not worth going in. Look at this Skarmory! Oh man, what's it like to have no no ability to focus on one sentence? Ask me and I wouldn't be able to answer because I wouldn't be able to focus on that sentence. That's for sure. All right, we got ourselves another egg. We got omelets, nothing but omelets. Crabby! Oh my goodness, this is a super, super good send in. Thank you so much. You are a male crabby. Oh my gosh, what do we have in the comments? What do we have in the comments? Uh, let's see, let's see. $100 Billy? Yo, does that fit? It's not gonna fit. Ah! Oh! Hold on, we're gonna make it fit. I love that name. All right, we're gonna drop all vowels. 100 Dollar, it still doesn't fit. But that needs to be your name. Hundred dollar Billy, yo, we're doing it. Hundred dollar Billy. <laughs> Please be legit. Hundred dollar Billy. It's like a hundred dollar buy. Knock off, endorse, slam, and blank move. Okay, so that that one move doesn't. It's it's okay. It'll just get erased. 
Um, it's not a real move. He only sent it in with three moves, which is fine. We're going to keep you $100 Billy. $100 Billy. Yeah, buddy. Vice Grip will get rid of this blank move, which it has one accuracy. Uh, and it didn't even have, it wasn't special or physical. I'll tell you that. I will tell you that. We have Leer. Uh, we'll keep, keep everything else we have. Knockoff sucks this gen, though. We got a lot of knockoff suggestion, a lot of knockoff Pokemon. And like, I mean, it's not terrible in the Drayano hack because sometimes, like, if we look at that um, solar power herb, yo, you're already learning Crab Hammer? You're absolutely broken! Yo, this Pokemon is broken. $100 Billy learns Crab Hammer at 16? A 90 base power move? How is that fair? Huge, impressive pincers. Grip and squeeze the foe. Oh, man. Uh, well, you're pretty weak, though. Slam is much stronger. We're going we're gonna to get the mud shot, just because. We're not going to keep it, I'm sure. We're not going to keep it, I'm sure. So how many do I have left? I think I have two left. I believe I have two left. I hope I'm not wrong on that. hope I don't accidentally hatch another an extra Pokemon. If I do, you guys will let me know and everything. But I'm pretty sure we've hatched one, two. Yeah, I think we're good. Okay. Let's go. Let's start rolling again. We got two more pokes. And then we got to decide on our team, man. We got a five again. Yo, today is lucky fives, man. And a four. No name Jones. No name Jones over here. Let's get it. What are you going to be? Tell me and I shall see into your deepest dreams. Oh, that's why it's changing the talk. I was like, why is it changing the talk at some point? Oh, no name Jones, pull up the comment section again. That's why you gotta, guys gotta leave those comments. Let me know your favorite Pokemon in today's episode. Um, we got... It's a joke. Is this a joke, man? That's it. Spencer Gavin, I'm calling you this guy, Gavin. Thank you so much, Spencer Gavin, for your comment. And thank you so much for the shady person who submitted this evil, evil Pokemon. Let's check him out. It is a lonely Pineco, as you should be, with double edge Toxic Spice, Power Trick, and Pin Missile. This Pokemon is ridiculously good. And it's got Sturdy. Such a good Pokemon for a Nuzlocke, despite me hating it, uh, because it causes me pain and sorrow. It is such a good Pokemon for a Nuzlocke. Oh, yeah, it's self-destruct. We'll learn it. Sure, man. I literally should. I would feel too bad. I mean, ooh, Bug Bite. I'll take Bug Bite over Pin Missile. That's for darn certain. Like, I don't, I, I honestly used to love, um, oh my gosh, what's Pineco's Evolution's name? Fortress. I used to love Fortress so much. I mean, I still love Fortress. It's a great Pokemon competitively. Uh, Rapid Spin we don't need in this game. Uh, I'm gonna, that's gonna bite me in the butt at some point. So I'm just gonna set a Stealth Rocks to sweep my team, I'm sure. We're not gonna go with Bide. We have level 20, we are good. We get to hatch another. We're cracking eggs and making omelets. Uh, let's grab our final Pokemon of the day. Our final Pokemon of the day. Then we got decision making time. Our first roll is going to be a two, tried and true. And then our next roll is going to be a two, tried and true. All right. Our final egg. Let's crack this bad boy open and see what is what. Skarmory, flap those wings a little bit harder and help this egg hatch. Flap those wings just a tiny bit harder. Just a little, just a little bit more breeze. A little bit more breeze, and we have we will have ourselves some action. It is a Weasel. Ooh, I love Weasel. What a cool Pokemon. Um, let's see. Are you a male or a female? You are a male. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Hmm. I'm gonna go with Mr. Arthas. Mr. Arthas, the potential. Oh, that's Mountain. Mount Arthas, yes. Mr. Arthas, thank you so much for your comment. I appreciate it. Uh, and you are now, you have been immortalized in this YouTuber's Nuzlocke. Oh boy. Graphics! Who needs them, all right? All right, so that's all the eggs we're hatching today. All the eggs it took us 25 minutes to hatch six or seven eggs. Seven eggs. Let's make sure we had seven because now I'm thinking that we only had six. Uh, our new Pokemon from today. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight. Did we hatch eight? Oh, I think we might have hacked has an extra one extra one. This one has technician. What? That's so good, Drayano. I got actually gotta I gotta level that guy up. Did we actually hatch an extra egg? Let's see. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. I lost I lost Aqua Tail quick attack. I'm gonna, um, you know what? I'm tired of Aqua Tail. I'm tired of it. Um Yes, we'll get rid of this broken move. What was I gonna say? What was I gonna say? We caught two Pokemon at the end of the last episode. We got gifted when we caught one. And then we got six. So we should have actually had eight. So let me make sure we had eight. We might be due for one more. You know, I should have learned Swift just because of the technician on this thing. Yo, if this, can get, if this thing can learn Aqua Jet by level up, that'd be fan freaking tastic. <clears throat> Let's make sure. Okay. So, new Pokemon today. Uh, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Got it. Okay, sweet. So we're good. We got all the Pokemon we need. Let's go ahead and get our original party back. Uh, Bert, Kyle. We have we have Stan, not Posse. Uh, we're definitely gonna keep Snowbell. So this was our party, and now we have to grab two more Pokemon. Who's gonna be best for us? Uh, we don't have too crazy of a fighting weakness right now. We already have a water type. Now we're getting a lot of water types. I'm actually pretty pretty tempted to grab the Pineco. Because uh, we have two fire resists. I'm pretty tempted to grab that Pineco right there. I mean, but Kabuto is so awesome. We have two grass resists. I love Kabuto. Ah! Um, we're gonna go with. Let me check these. Uh, you know, we're gonna go with we're gonna go with Kabuto. We're gonna add Kabuto to the party. So we're not gonna add Sudo Wudo. We're not gonna add Marsh Tomp, I don't think. Um, Marsh Tomp's so good, but... I think I'm gonna add the Skarm. The Skarm only has, what, two weaknesses, fire and electric? It's just too good. Let's add the Skarmory as well. We need a nice, nice defensive Pokemon. And we have an electric immunity anyway, despite our two electric weaknesses. All right, let's get it. Let's get it. This is our team right here, updated on the layout. We have Spike the Skarmory, Ethan the Kabuto, Snowbell, Stan the Power, and Bert Kyle. Nothing but real names over here. Nothing but the realest of names. Uh, with that being said, I love how the barrel's just already facing backwards. Uh, this is awkward, the barrel. Can you stop? Stop twerking on me! Uh, let's go ahead and just heal up just because I'm nervous. I'm a nervous Nelly. Party of six. We got places to be, things to do, but I don't think we're going to be doing them today. Uh, we're so close in time. Actually, let's just see if we can start an event. Let's see if there's anything we can take advantage of. The Radio Tower in Goldenrod City is a landmark. They're running a promotional campaign right now. They'll modify your Pokegear so it can also serve as a radio. We should probably take care of that ASAP because I always forget to do that. Ooh, we have the the Magnet Train line for J Johto to Kanto. So this is the radio tower. Uh, what do you want? You pass scram. I'm going inside the radio tower. You don't yell at me. I'm just a human being. Welcome to Golden Rod's radio tower. Oh. oh, here we go. Here we go. Hi, my name is Whitney. I heard about the quiz to win a radio card, so I came here to get one. But this quiz is so hard. All right, so let's win one. We have a special quiz campaign. It has five questions correctly in a row to win a radio card. When you load it into Pokemon Gear, you'll be able to listen to the radio anytime, anywhere. Would you like to try our quiz? Yeah, that's the first question. Can you check the town map with Pokemon Gear? Yes. The second question. Nidorina can only be female. Yes. Kurt, the Pokeball creator, uses apricots. They're apricorns. They're not apricots. It's impossible to use TM on Magikarp, true? Yes. And our final question. In Professor Oak's popular show, it's not Marie, it's Mary. I always get that one wrong. I thought I got it wrong because of the delay. We got our radio card. I can now listen to the radio with my radio card. Bam. Uh, oh, wow, well, you did it. I thought the answer to the third question was surely apricots. Oops, it's time to go back to the gym. All right, so we actually had to do that in order to trigger the gym event. Um, but I don't think we're gonna be going to the gym yet. I don't know, actually, you know what, let's do this. Let's do this, we got time, right? Yeah, we got time, we got time, we got time. Let's go ahead and let's snag a single battle in the gym. I don't know if I should grind before the gym. And I know, Shady's famous last words. My team is strong. Yo, champ in the making. This gym is home to normal type Pokemon trainers. I recommend you use fighting type Pokemon. Well, I don't have any, so. <clears throat> Sucks to suck. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna let, <clears throat> actually Snowbell has a fighting type move, let's get it. 
Yo, Snowbell. Carry me, baby. Carry me like the bell you are. Oh, you're a cute little trainer. I like you, but I won't hold back. You're hitting on me, man. We just met. This is crazy. I just met you. Wismer. Okay, we got a Wismer here. Making a lot of noise. Level 20. All right. So that means that she'll probably be, probably be around level 25. Which means I probably should grind up. Ooh, hold on. We might not have to. Double kick. Bah! Double kick. Bah! Uh, we should probably get to around level 23, 24 with our Pokemon. Uh, so we'll probably do a little grinding in between these episodes. Uh, snubble. Because I don't want I really don't want to go through another catastrophe like we did. Was it yesterday? I actually have blocked it all out two days ago. Like, I, I really, I don't want to. So I think that perhaps, mayhaps, mayhaps grinding it out will be the best thing for us. Did you intimidate me or something? Because all of a sudden I'm doing pitiful damage. Pitiful damage. I am part fighting right now. I am part fighting. So I should be rocking your face with my big toe. That's what should be happening. Beauty Victoria is going to send out Teddy Ursa. Uh, let's go out into Spike. That's the other thing. We got Spike. We got a modest. Nope, we got a timid Spike. Even better than modest. We got a timid Spike. Uh, let's go ahead. Let's see how much a Steel Wing does. I'm curious. We miss. Steel Wing does zero damage. Not very effective. There we go, Spike. That's what Spike does. Yo, and we have Roost that we can teach Spike. We do have Roost. Ooh, Steel Wing. When you connect, you connect the dots, my friends. Go for a Brave Bird. I don't like recoil, but you know what? It's not double edge. It's okay. It's not double edge. We'll take a couple couple points of recoil and take that Teddy Ursa out. So I think we should grind up to like level 23. I don't want to go too much higher than that. I think 23 will be a good point for us to do before the next episode. So that's going to wrap it up for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, don't forget to show some shady love to that thumbs up down below and hit subscribe already if you haven't. Have yourselves a fantastic day, but above all else, keep it shady.